if he does transition to the IFBB, what do you think his prospects are? Do you think he could be someone that could, you know, go right to the top and challenge the likes of a big Rami, Brandon Curry, Nick Walker? No, but I think he, in the future, certainly can. He's got a ton of muscle, this guy. I mean, he's got re- the, he's got the great showy body parts, arms, shoulders, pecs, you know, he's got flaring, you know, lats, he's got good legs. I think that, you know, he's, I think he's a year or two off from, from really being, you know, amazing, you know, but I think he's certainly has, the, there's no doubt he's got the tool set to be at the top. Will he come over here? I don't know. I'm sure Raphael has got him or wherever he competes. I think he competes in the elite over there. Or I don't even know if he even has an elite pro card yet. I think he's still just a Russian champion, right? From what I understand. Yeah, I'm, to be very honest yeah. with you, I'm... Uh, yeah, I think I had this discussion with someone. Yeah. We had this discussion already. He's not even like a, a pro yet, theoretically. So I hope he comes to the IPB Pro League because that's the best. And I think that he will make a big splash in this division initially, right away, because he's got the size to stand with these guys. I think, you know, in terms of refining what he had, kind of like what Rami had going on. And when Rami first came in, he was unbelievable, but he still had a lot of refining to do. I think once he refines what he's got, I think it's going to take another year or two. He's going to be very dangerous. Absolutely. He'll be competing at the top Olympia level.